And the technology is really interesting. We put this instrument uh, down on the bench. Uh, I thought to myself, oh, it's going to replace this instrument. But then, then I realized it's going to replace that one, it's going to replace this one, it's going to replace those four behind you, and it's going to replace all those in there too. And, and what's important, I guess, also to mention is that right now it's ideal for a certain case type, for certain sample types, not all sample types. Like the sheriff said, the touch DNA sample types, our old system is more, um, um, it's more sensitive, so it's better for those types. Tell them what touch DNA is. So touch DNA would be like if I swab that doorknob. Um, so a doorknob or point of entry type of case um, samples from cases of break-ins or, or property crimes, those type of samples and those type of cases have very small amounts of DNA. So those, those probably still run through the, the other system. Yeah, it's more sensitive. But this instrument, for, for anything you put your mouth on, cigarette butts, um, Coke cans, water bottles, if you chew on your pencil, that kind of thing, um, as well as um, blood, um, any other saliva samples. Um, we've gotten a profile from a single hair, from a steering wheel swab. So it, it, it is sensitive in some of those samples, but um, we know it'll work straight out with the more, uh, the higher concentration DNA samples. So this cartridge is, is kind of the, um, uh, the interesting part to me about it. Um, so you can see right there, this, the swab goes directly into the cartridge. And this cartridge has a drinking straw. So uh, I ate breakfast at McDonald's that morning. I brought the straw in. I stuck it in here. Um, we ran some other samples during validation. And then this has all the reagents um, or chemicals to run the test. Um, in this part, um, and this whole cartridge along with uh, this one goes into this instrument like this. Actually, it goes like this. So you push them down, basically enter the sample name information, and hit the button and walk away. And 90 minutes later, um, it prints out um, a DNA profile. Um, so the steps that were involved before were you, you, you process or cut the sample, you extract it, you quantitate it, you amplify it, then you do separation on this instrument. All that now is done with these cartridges in this instrument.